show you how to predict a large protein complex, uh, we'll have 2,000 amino acids, using AlphaFold from within Chimera X. So uh, let me bring up the AlphaFold tool under Tool Structure Prediction AlphaFold, and I'll paste in the sequence. Uh, I'm going to just copy and paste um, the sequences I'm interested in. Uh, there are eight sequences here. I've separated by them, separated them with commas. It's an octamer. There are actually four, only four different proteins, but there are two copies of each protein. So I just copied that, um, and I'm going to paste it into the box here. And then I press predict, and then we get this alpha fold run panel. And uh, it's going to ask me here, it says this was not authored by Google, do you want to run it? And I'm going to say, instead of saying run anyway, that's what I normally do, I say cancel. Uh, the reason I'm saying cancel is because this 2,000 amino acids is too long, too big uh, number of amino acids, too big a structure to predict on the normal GPUs that Google Colab uh, offers you. Those GPUs, like a T NVIDIA T4, have 16 gigabytes, and they can only predict up to about 1,200 amino acids. Since this is 2,000, the prediction would start running, but then it would fail. So how do I switch it? I'm going to switch it to a higher power, a GPU with more memory. I go on this alpha fold run to runtime, change runtime. And then it says GPU type. And I have choices here. I might say T4 for you. But A1, an A100, that's the fanciest GPU Google offers now. It has 40 gigabytes of memory. And then I'll say save that. And then this little black triangle here, I'm going to click this in order to run now with this um, GPU with more memory. And then now when it says, do you want to run this? It's not authored by Google. I cl click run anyway. OK, so now we're off and running with this GPU with 40 gigabytes. And I've run this before. It will take about one hour. Um, to run. You can see in the output that's appeared here, it says using NVIDIA A100 SXM4 40 gigabyte graphics processor. So that's a good sign. That's, uh, that's what we needed. If it says using NVIDIA T4, that only has 16 gigabytes and this larger structure wouldn't predict correctly. So after an hour, let me just bring up my other copy of Chimera X where I already ran this. And I'll show you uh, what it looks like. Here's the structure it brought up and the little alpha fold um, run panel. Here's what it looks like. Uh, I found multiple sequence alignments. It's showing me the multiple sequence alignments in a plot. And then it predicted five models. Each of them took about 10 minutes. And here are those models and the error plots associated with them. Uh, when Chimera X um, when it finishes, it opens the best model, but it will say in the log, uh, results have been downloaded to downloads, Chimera X, AlphaFold, prediction, underscore, 63. That's because I ran 62 previous predictions. It will be some different number for you. All right, so that's how you run AlphaFold uh, with a GPU with more memory on Google Colab. The thing is, this is going to cost you money. Um, because you're only going to get that A100 uh, GPU if you have a paid Google Colab service. And you see up in the left corner here of my AlphaFold run thing, it says it has the little goal, Colab to orange circle symbol and Pro, because I'm paying $10 a month for Colab Pro. And um, that gets you some compute units so that you can use a nicer GPU. Um, we can see what it used here. If I look under runtime, view resources, um, it says uh, I have 329 compute units and I'm using them at 13 units per hour. Um, if you, that's be, the 13 units per hour is because I'm using a nicer GPU. Um, I get 100 units a month for and that's $10, so they're $0.10 cents each. So this was $1.30 per hour to do this run. Um, 
with my 100 units that I get for one month of Colab Pro, well, this took um, about 13 units. I'm only going to get in about seven runs in the whole month of this size. And if you go to, say, 3,000 amino acids, which is probably the maximum you can do on this GPU, you'll um, only get even fewer runs in. But you can pay for more um, units. So for, let me just show you. If we go to um, a search for um, co uh, Google Colab Pro, and here this goes to the, the Google Colab where you can um, sign up for this ten month, ten dollars a month service, or there's a fifty dollar a month service, or you can just pay for these compute units, like ten dollars for a hundred compute units. All right, so that's how you can uh, run larger structure predictions uh, by paying Google um, a fairly modest sum. Thanks for listening.